So welcome everybody. Hope you all are doing alright. Let's just start off with some tips real quick. What I do when I get into a game to make sure it's work is I try to buy armor. But getting to the armory is kind of difficult. So I go in my arcade. I go to my, M uh, my MK2 workshop here. And I check to see if uh, I can purchase. If this doesn't come up then I know something's wrong. Then I go to the armory and see there, because sometimes you got some blowhards that uh, mess up when they shoot the, the ammo clerk guy, whatever. And then you can't purchase anything, so. But I'm in my game, you know, I'm just chilling. Trying to figure out what I'm going to do, because it's, it's uh, double the money on uh, VIP stuff, so I'm like, alright, that's cool. But <clears throat> there's been a lot more uh, griefers lately, so... You know, I'm getting, I have to travel more prepared. And I was, I saw a video on an individual that uh, changed his, uh, used a different weapon. I was like wondering, well, maybe I'll go from photo metal jacket to the armor piercing or maybe back. Maybe switch some of the weapons, you know. So I'm just debating about that. No, people, I'm not rambling. At this point, I'm looking around, you know, because on the map, I have a car outside. And I don't know what personal vehicle I use, and I was trying to figure that out. Because I like to know, because I try to travel with a purpose. Because uh, there's been so many griefers uh, this past week. So I'm like, alright, look around, I don't really see anybody in my area. So I'm like, alright, I'm going to go, because I'm going to go to the armory and check. See if the game's good, see if the lobby's good. Then I'm going to see about getting friends in and all that stuff. So as you see, I'm getting my weapons <clears throat> ready and checking. That's the one, my Carbon MK2 and uh, the special carbon I was thinking about. Which one was going to have the full metal jacket armor piercing? The blue one, whatever. And look, all of a sudden, boom, there's a guy right there. So I try to get in some cover. Boom. Let me pause that for you. So now that I got that paused couple things I want you to look at. Can you see my mouse? No, you can't see my mouse so well. Let's back that up. So we're going to go. Another little tip for you. Boom. Even though this is a pole right here, it can give you a little bit of cover. That's kind of cool, you know? Alright. So. Uh, I don't know if I can catch that just right. He pulls his, he gets out and he pulls his weapon, so he just stops there. See, so he's already pulling his weapon out. You know, now if he was coming to the garage, he'd have just pulled it and drove. No, or went to the front door. No, he's coming to uh, attack me. And his color, I'm not sure if it's pink or if it's the color where, you know, someone's going psycho, which means they've been killing a lot. So, right off the bat, look at this. How to take care of business. I mean, all I wanted to do... Whew, all I wanted to do was go to the armory, get my friends in, and do some VIP missions. So now I'm going to go back. So I'm going to go back and uh, get my other video ready now. But I'm going to go back. Change my weapons, though, the way I wanted to. And then we get some good stuff going on. Let me find it. There we go. So, later on in the game, I'm doing some VIP missions. You know, piracy and things. And when I hire somebody, in case anybody gets in my lobby, if I hire you, not only am I trying to make money, but I'm trying to make you money. And this week, like I said, it's double as we're waiting for another... Uh, VIP, you know, executive search, hauling, um, hostile takeover, whatever. I gotta wait like, you know, four minutes. And sometimes other players start it. So I was like, alright, well, we'll do a VIP challenge. Um, I chose the ATM one because that one's fun to do. I wasn't trying to be um, ahead or first place because I want the first place person to get, you know, some dough. 
So as we're doing that, this uh, individual stalks me, griefer or tryhard. I guess it's I guess the, the word is actual tryhard. And uh, let's just uh, watch a little bit of that. You guys ready for that? Let's watch. Oh, I gotta tell you before we watch that. My bad, I got ahead of myself. See, anyways, I'm doing the ATM thing. I'm in my MOC. And I'm waiting, you know, for my uh, employees to get high earned points and for it to end so we can start something else. And sure enough, I get I get hit. I didn't see the guy. He's off the radar. For starters, he's off the radar. All right, so I can't see him. So I'm like, well, if I'm going to get hit from somewhere, I need protection. So I call out, I can bring him around. you know, my uh, tank, I'll my TM-02. And I'm looking for him. I know he's over there towards the left of me on the other side of that building. So I'm like, I got to get some cover. I got to see if I can get my vehicle before he comes out. Because he's off the radar still. And I'm like, all right. And here we go. Up oh, there he is. See? Do you see the per uh, oppressor already? So already he gets his oppressor out. And blammo. So now I got to pause it. So I blow him out of the freaking sky. No auto aim. I have to free aim. This goes on. He gives me some messages about, you know, I'm hiding. I wouldn't go toe to toe with him. And this is what I want you guys to tell me. What do you guys think about this? About me going on the ground toe to toe where I'm on the ground and the motherfucker's got a oppressor. How is that a fair fight or a challenge? Anyhow, you know, as you can see, um, earlier in the game, he got killed by me. Um, for whatever reason, I had a landmine out. I think someone was doing a hostile takeover, and I had my excursion out, and I was uh, laying landmines. And for whatever reason, this guy found it. So, you know... Now, you know, and as you can tell from the right of the screen, I'm doing ATM. I'm not griefing. I'm not trying to go after people. He fucking dies. You know, tough shit. It's also going to go on. Let's see. Well, let's go a little more. So let's just go on and see what we do here. Because this is just crazy. Let me know what you guys think, though, you know. Kind of curious about that. So now I gotta go find him. So I know he's gonna spawn in a sec. Cause so I'm like, I'm not in the mood to get grief. I'm waiting, like I said, for my other employees to do well. Cause it's double the money. <clears throat> this is paid out pretty good. See? I wasn't even, you know, going after people or grief or any of that junk. Minding my own business. But this guy. This is what's called, I guess, try hard trying to keep his kill death. He's also a level 500 and something. And he's already still shooting at me. I'm like, alright, well, he's just gonna, you know. So I'm gonna stay on him for a while. I'm gonna grief the griefers, you know. But he's a tr try hard, so I don't know how to. I guess I'm griefing a try hard. He's still trying to shoot. Officer Stanley's his name, so he died. I don't know if he died on accident there or on purpose. But over here, the story kind of changes. You're going to get some other tips out of this, too. See, he died. He killed himself. And so later on, like I mentioned, he, uh, you know, says I, I hide. Well, he's hiding in his uh, garage. And I'm like, I'm not hiding. I'm actually in my facility to... Um, Get my slacks, get my associates back so we can go do the Doom, Doomsday mission, because that's what they wanted to do. I was like, alright. And plus, my tank isn't going to last all day. Oh, there's a tip I wanted to tell you guys. As you're watching the map. Let's see. Let's soon. He's going to disappear. He's going to disappear here soon. Oh, I thought it was over here. I guess he did disappear. 
All right, he's got to come back. Oh, there he is. All right, because this, this area is important. Something cool is going to happen. See, he killed himself again. And I'm the one that's chicken. So what do you guys think? Do you think I'm the one chicken? Because he's the one that keeps killing himself. So if you kill yourself, then everyone around you is the chicken shit. So I'm trying to get him again. But see how he disappeared? And there's no X. He just got the bandit. Another tip for you guys. He just got the bandit. And now he's rolling around. Oh, see, it just went that way. Barely saw it. Yeah, I didn't see that. See if I can catch that again. I believe that's it right there. Yep, see, there's the bandit. There it is. There he goes. Didn't even see it happen so fast. See? So he wants to go toe toe. He uses an impressor. He goes off radar. And he's also using the bandit and I'm I mean let me know what you guys think I'm really curious about that hello you're through to Meriwether security consulting so I get the mercenary out because it's it, it's a cool way to keep this thing up so Got I can it. see you know where he is if he's outside still because I didn't even dawn on me that he got the bandit it wasn't until later I was like oh that's what he must have done that's also on cell now I'm getting hit see now, if you listen, my tank's getting ready to blow up. I'm like, I need a new vehicle. So I'm going to go to my facility, fix it. There's another tip for you. This is how you guys handle griefers and try hard. So as I said, the ATM mission's over. You know. See, that's the individuals jumping in. So on top of that, he calls someone you know for help he wants to go toe-to-toe -to -toe, one on one but now he's got another person one with an impressor he's got the impressor mark two the other guy's got the regular one and you know he continues to go on you know saying I'm I'm chicken and I'm mad and I'm like yeah I'm mad that I've killed him over and over over and over that's just so you know upsetting crazy right so I don't know I'm kind of curious what you guys thoughts are um, oh yeah the mission's over I gotta put my money up that's another good reason to go into a facility because like I said the griefers are out so I'm gonna deposit some of my money oh that's another part of the video all right so, eventually, my associate uh, comes back and... Alright, now my cats are fighting. A little uh, information for you guys. But anyway, so the associate comes back. We're going to go. And he's hiding this whole time, like I said, in his garage. So let me know how him hiding, him killing himself, riding around in a bandit, also getting someone for help, makes me the chicken shit. So, leave your comments below. Let me know what you guys think. Um, yeah, that's all I got. See you guys next time on the next, uh, I think I'm going to call this, Griefers and Tryhards versus me. All right. You guys have been fantastic. I'll see you guys next time. I also try to stream on Tuesdays in the evening. Check Twitter, Twitter, Twitch for the schedule. All right. Peace out.